How's it going YouTube? I'm going to walk you through on how to enable the ability to boot from more than one device on a Samsung Series 7 all-in-one flat panel touchscreen. This is a model DP700A3D-A0IUS. Alright, so when you first turn the PC on, you can rapidly press F10 and it will give you the boot options. I'm rapidly pressing F10. So on this particular BIOS, it's saying that I only have the ability to do the boot manager or enter setup. It's not giving me any other options. So I'm going to enter setup. And I'm going to go to the boot tab and set boot order. And again, there's only one option the boot manager. So what I've found you can do is change this, the fast boot to disabled and the secure boot to disabled and change this mode, the OS mode selection, to the UEFI and CSMOS. Alright, and I'm just going to go to exit and save my changes and then once I press yes it'll save my changes put me back at the beginning so I'm gonna start pressing F10 rapidly after I press yes or enter so I'm pressing F10 rapidly okay and there it is I have all the options to boot from so I have uh, this is the DVD player you can see the DVD RAM that's the onboard hard drive and this is the external hard drive that I have plugged in for my backup. Alright, that concludes the video on how to enable more than one boot devices when it's not enabled. This may work on other devices, this is just the Samsung Series 7 all-in-one uh, flat panel touchscreen that I have. So, hope you enjoy.